Today we headed out to site to visit the drywall gangsters. Now these guys are no strangers to using the Tape Pro original mud box. They definitely got their system down to a fine art. What they did is give us some very useful insights on how to use the mud box and also how to improve their productivity of taping in, helping them keep up with the demand of their builder. I hope you guys will enjoy. They've got some great insight. Check it out. Yo! Oh, like a full day to understand how it works and maybe another day or two to get used to it. Like if you, the more angle you put it, see this metal cutter, the more angle you put it, the more tape it's gonna cut. So the closer you do like that, the less it's gonna cut. So not every tape machine always cuts it the same, but like you can just, so the less angle you put, the closer it'll get that, like the further away it is. If you're too close to and you keep hitting the ceiling, you can always pull the paper back out of the box and then cut it and you've shortened it again. So sometimes they try and cut it and it's not cutting because they've gone too long or it's slipped. You can pull it through and watch it come through and then go back up. We don't have a whole house full, he can just hold it with the roller. I'll go a meter, he'll roll it and then it stops moving. I'll use this corner so I didn't bother getting too far. He just rolls with me. And then same thing, you get a big angle on your box and look how close you can get it to you. It takes us about an hour to take walls and ceilings and then about from just under an hour to do the entire About 45 time. minutes. I'd say between mixing and starting and everything, you've got two hours to take in about 900, but 900 in townhouses. So that's, you know, four bathrooms, that's eight bedrooms. This was a thousand meters of just one house, it'd go even quicker. Mm -hmm. 